All right, what's up, everybody? Let's look at Arena 6. We're going to be using Lime. We're going to be using Unicorn, the Pom Poms, the Compass, and the Roll Bear Treasure. We are not using the Legend. Now, I would recommend if you have the Legend Treasure, use it. Replace the Pom Poms with the Legend, and you're going to be looking at a 30 to 40 million point score increase. Uh, my only tip for Lime is as soon as you get the, the small balls, jump it and spike it. Like, as soon as you've got it, just go for it. Uh, so, obviously, t like, depending on where you are on the map, if there's loads of little things, like loads of little platforms, yeah, sure, give it a bit of a wait, but do not wait too long. You're going to want to get them out ASAP. And especially, like, before a skill. If you can get that out just before a skill does, uh, a main skill activates, you're going to be at, you're going to be, like, one step ahead, in a way. So... It is definitely, definitely recommended to blast them out as soon as you get them here. I had to wait a little bit. And to be honest, it wasn't a bad wait. It's because, you know, otherwise I would have missed quite a lot. Here, there is a T up there. However, I knew I was going to get a little um, volleyball, which is why I slipped down early. So I could get everything. Also, if I would have double jumped, I would have probably gone a bit too far ahead. Unfortunately, did not manage to get the small ball out before, so I had to do it afterwards. And because of that, you don't you lose charge during, um, you lose time, pretty much, and potential points. And uh, points are everything, really, aren't they, in Guild Run? So make, be aware of that. Now, I don't actually use the fall at all. The M is with the uh, what's that thing called? The M is with the giant jelly and then the E is afterwards. Do not miss the T. Do not miss the M. They are very, very easy to miss. I went in the top route. The top route has all the bears. And what do we get with the treasure? More points for the bears. You're going to absolutely slay in this bonus time with all the bears. Here, we miss about one and then we go into a skill just before the health runs out as well. Now, as I said, the whistle does save uh, you from a fall. Here, I've made to sure to use the, the volleyball afterwards. I managed to collect the health, which gave me a little bit of extra distance. So, absolutely recommend doing that. Um, I did not use the fall for either cookie. Here, I nearly missed the health potion but luckily with the magnet from the from the compass and um, like enhancing the magnetic ability magnetic ability of the skill i managed to grab it so be careful of that jump though here unfortunately because of my timing before i didn't get an extra volleyball out but it's fine go 500 515 million or so going into unicorn's first skill now you do get a re you do get a revive as well with the relay with the whistle so do not forget that don't just think oh my god where am i going to get all these points from you will get a revive so just be aware i know it's like a pretty old pet but it's one of those pets that i've not used for a while so the first time i ran it i did forget that we were going to get a revive. And it's like, ooh. So do not forget that. Here you can majority of just walk over everything until the uh, another bonus time with a health. Do not do not short jump that and miss the health. The health is absolutely in uh, absolutely necessary. Uh, I missed a rainbow bear there. That was uh, I didn't notice that before. That was poor execution on my part poor execution however plenty of rainbow bears so go whichever way you want i don't think it matters really at the end of that uh but yeah the actual the end of it is a lot easier i would say uh, than the start so you've actually have an easier time with unicorn than you do with lime also unicorn skill is natively magnetic for the rainbow bears so the compass just makes it just a lot better uh obviously we're going to be wanting to go as far as we can with the unicorn before the revive and this is kind of where we've got to be a little bit careful. Now, we do get a health potion right there, but that is pretty much it. We only have to collect three, and it makes it look like we're going to have plenty of time. I can't believe I missed all those rainbow bears. However, oh no, there's another health potion. Whoop! I was just kidding. I was just kidding. So we only need one more, but it looks like we've got a lot of health. Be careful. It is very easy. Here, I'm going to drop down a short jump it and then jump into it if i would have landed that on the edge of that platform i would have ended the run and you are 30 40 million points wasted 
uh, from what score you could have. Last minute jumps into the Rainbow Bears. 903, nearly 904 million. Only an A+, plus, but the Legend Treasure would boost you up to an S easily. However, that is the no Legend Run. Like, comment, and subscribe. If I can do a Legend Run next time, I will. Until then, bye-bye.